Before you start worrying about what lies beneath, Consider this, the likelihood of being attacked by a shark is very low compared to your chances of getting caught in the dangerous rip current. On average, rip currents also account for more deaths in Australia each year than bushfires, floods and cyclones combined. Rips are strong, narrow currents characterized by waves breaking across a wide area. Channelized or fixed rips are the most common and look like dark gaps between areas of white water. They can occur and stay in the same place for days, weeks, or even months. Flash rips are caused by large surf buildup in a short period of time. They can appear suddenly without warning. Boundary or topographic rips occur next to headlands and structures like jetties. To spot a rip, look for deeper, darker water, fewer breaking waves, a rippled surface surrounded by still water, or foamy, discoloured, sandy water flowing out beyond the waves. If you get caught in the rip, try to remain calm. Raise an arm and call out for help. Float with the current as it may return you to a shallow sandbank, or swim to the side of the rip towards the breaking waves until you escape the rip current. But the best way to avoid a rip current is by staying between the flags on patrolled beaches. If in doubt, don't go out never go in beyond your waist and always spend a few minutes considering beach safety. The Australian Academy of Science. Because questions need answers.